Hey guys, it's Val here and welcome back to my channel if you haven't been here already. So today's video is going to be a what's in my bag video. Now I haven't done one of these in a while. I used to do one every season and this year I think I did it once. I really did suck. I apologize guys if you wanted to be nosy and see what's in my purse. It was actually requested in one of my videos because I think you can see it on my display with my shoes. So without further ado, let's just get into it. Now this is my first ever designer bag, and it's the Alexander Wang Rocky bag in the acid color. It's yellow to me, but everyone thinks it's like a green. I think it's just a combination, that's why it's called acid. But I really like this bag. I got this bag pre-loved off of eBay, and I know you're like, mm, pre-loved, eBay. And sometimes it's kind of iffy on there, and trust me, I know, but... And especially for the price, so I was a little more hesitant because it was way cheaper than the actual price. The seller was really sweet and she sells a lot of designer pieces her, like from her closet. So I, after talking to her about, you know, seeing more pictures, because she only had like I think two or three pictures that were kind of dull looking. So I wanted to see more and the reason why she was selling it so cheap. And the reason was... Even though the front was all beautiful, the back was very messed up from like water damage and color transfer, which to me, nobody's going to see the back of the bag anyways, so I thought it was a great opportunity to just snatch this bag up. Um, I did wipe it down when I got it. It wasn't as bad as it is now, but I've had this since February, March. So, of course, I've worn this to death. I had a, I have a black coat that I would sometimes wear it with. I wear jeans all the time. So, I'm like, I'm not cautious like most people are. Especially because it's a bag. You're supposed to use it. You're supposed to get it a little, you know, worn up. So, I really... It has just the nice details on the bottom and on the top. I really like this color combo. I love the fact that it has the strap so you can either wear the crook of your arm, which sometimes I do if there's less things in this bag. Most of the time I carry it just here. I don't carry it cross body just because it looks weird and I'm short so it looks perfect for me. But it comes like this and on this side has the Alexander Wang um, logo there. So anyways, let's just get into let's just get into what's in my bag, but two things that aren't in my bag that are normally in my bag. One would be water. Now, Fiji water is my all-time favorite. The reason why this isn't in here because it's too big and I normally carry the small one when I'm carrying this bag because you guys know about that whole dehydration situation that I've been through. And then my phone here is the iPhone iPhone 5S. Nothing special. I'm Again, I, a phone is a phone to me. I'm not, like, I have to have that new phone. Although it's nice, but the outside, I just have this cute little puff thingy that I got from eBay that took forever and a day to come. And I have a clip here because you just never know when you need to pick up your hair. Even though I always carry a hair tie on my wrist, just never know. So this is the inside of, of the bag. It's pretty organized, it's not a lot, but this is my bag and I go on the train or if I'm going traveling somewhere where I'm by myself so I carry a couple of things just to keep me occupied. So the first thing I have here is my Rome little notebook that I got from Deals for about a dollar with a pen inside. I like this to just jot down things or just, just to have a notebook because you just never know when you need paper or a pen. And another thing that I have in here is Michael Loiser's Law of Attraction book. That's a workbook. It's the workbook version of The Secret. So if you want more in-depth details about this book, let me know in the comments below and I'll be happy to share it with you. So I also love jotting down um, whatever's in the workbook into that notebook too. So good to read for when you're on the train and you're bored and you're by yourself. Then I have my little emergency kit because you never know. So... If you guys watch my Bernier Jolie unboxings, you know I own like 3,000 of these pouches and they come in handy. So I have a brush. I don't always carry this, but like I said, when I'm going somewhere for a long period of time, my hair gets a little, mm -hmm. So I carry a few hair ties and a brush. I have a nail file in here, some band-aids and bobby pins. I have a hat because in New York, it's up and down with the weather. I'm not really complaining because given the fact that it's December and it's really warm out. But sometimes in my building, in the hallway, it'll be really hot and then I'll go outside and it's freezing outside. So you just never know and I always have to carry a hat or something with me or a sweater. 
Then I have my ever so lovely iPhone 4S because I don't have music in my 5S. I have all my music in here. So this is basically my iPod. So this is what's left in here. Receipts, receipts, receipts. I have like a ton of receipts because it's that season of gifting. So I've just been shopping for everyone and I just, I'm the type of person who just throws the receipts in there. Then on this side of the bag, I have, if it comes out, my Elizabeth and James Nirvana White Perfume. This is my signature scent. I love this stuff. So I carry that because I only have the rollerball. Then I have another, this is kind of like my makeup bag. Um, sorry if you hear music because my neighbors are, are really rude and they just blast music all day, every day. So this is like my makeup bag. I have a mini hand sanitizer from Bath & Body Works. I have my Too Faced Color Balm lip injection. And I have a L'Occitane mini sample hand cream. I have a mini sample Makeup Forever lipstick and a Burt's Bees lip balm. So I just threw all that in there. Some Winter Fresh because I always have to have gum or candy or something. Um, I have just a brand new, well, it's not a brand new pack. I have a pack of tissue because for some reason my nose gets really drippy. And then I have a candy cane that came in my Bonjour Jolie box this week. Then the last thing on this side is the zipper pocket with the logo, with the stamp, this, with the stamp Alexander Wang tag on it. Sorry guys, I'm so out of breath. Because I just want to get through this. So I have my little pouch here. It's a YSL little pouch. It came with one of my makeup items I got from Influencer. So I thought instead of carrying my Rebecca Minkoff thing that I won years ago. To switch it up to this. And I really like it. I just carry my cards in here. My Metro card. Because when you're in New York City. And you live in Brooklyn. You just, you know. I have movie tickets in here. I just have everything in here. And I just, this is just so compact for me I can just slip it in any purse that I want thing aside from probably what 11 cents in there I have this little pouch my mother gave me because she's addicted to buying little small knickknacks so in here I have a sub summer's eve cleansing cloth because I mean come on nobody wants you know things happening down there more hair ties more band-aids and just change it's full of change in here that that's the point of this is to change first and my keys i just put these on the side i'm pretty simple when it comes to having my keys i just have this key um this keychain a whole bunch of rewards cards i have this one that my friend erica gave me and a little sheet that i got from ireland and that's that. That's everything in my bag. Let me know in the comments below what's in your bag, what's random. I, one time I did pull out a condom. That, that was kind of a random thing. That was my first ever what's in my bag video. But um, yeah, what was the weirdest thing you've ever pulled out of your what's in my, your purse? Or what's the weirdest thing you carry in your bag? I would love to know. Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, up, like this video if you're enjoying Vlogmas. Slash you would like to see more what's in my bags or what I carry in a smaller bag. Love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching and tuning in as always. I really appreciate it and I'll see you guys tomorrow for another video. Bye guys!